And while that's squeezing, let's uh, see what else we can do. Let's first of all... Uh, there is another sort of... Uh, bee house. Old bee house. Let's see... Uh, let's see if we can find that. Bee house, there we go. And that's... Glowing comb, shimmery comb, dusty comb. This just says ordinary homely comb, we can do this. That said honeycomb, excellent. And we have a honeycomb. So let's try making one of those. And we're starving again. Let's try, let's try a hearty breakfast. Love the way you eat it plate as well. Uh, hello Gertie Simmers. Alright, so like that. And then we want, actually we want some slabs first. Okay, so we want planks around like that. Let's hope this works. Because I really be finding this frustrating to be honest. Okay, so we use a bee house instead of an apiary. So I want to know why the apiary wasn't working, but I don't want to wait. So here we go. We'll place the bee house down. So we'll place it down, say there, and then we can put in here a princess and a drone. Okay, and that. There we go. Alright, so now we need to get this working. The first problem is the sky is obstructed and forest drones need to be able to see the sky, so... There you go. And now that is now working. And if you notice, the, all these bees come out of it. Okay. And... What's going to happen here is this bar on the side here is the uh, the queen's life okay the princess turned into a queen and the drone disappeared so this bar is slowly going to go down and we'll get a princess and at least one drone here and while that's working oh no flowers oh yes i forgot about that bitch we need a flower and i okay All right, actually look the other day okay i spent several hours bone mealing this place and then uh, punching to start the grass and I found after using what was it about three stacks of bones I got one flower okay one single solitary flower that is the only flower in the game guys the only flower so I don't know if this will place on uh, clay. It would be great if it does. It won't. Okay, so let's punch that out. And let's go and get a piece of earth. Do I have any on me? No. Go and get a piece of earth. And we'll put this piece of earth down and we'll put this flower on it. Hey guys, this is our only flower. One flower! I know! I think it's due to Pam's Harvest Craft, which uh, provides so many other things that was uh, getting in the way of the flowers being spawned. But still, that was amazing. So, stick a bit of earth down. Stick a flower down. If an Enderman comes along and takes that flower, or takes that piece of earth and kills that flower, we're done for. Right. Hive members not finding the right flowers. Will that change? Uh, okay, this is a forest. No, okay, right, they found them again. Okay, right, it was possibly because it just needed a bit of time to reset. So there we go, we now have our bees chugging away. And they're going to use that flower and they're going to pollinate these trees. And occasionally, just occasionally, these bees are going to cross pollinate these leaves. <laughs> I know, I know. 
the one flower. Okay, so yeah, occasionally these bees are going to cross-pollinate these leaves. And the, as part of the cross-pollination, we are going to get completely new species of trees. And so, of course, this being Minecraft, we need an object in order to, to see this. And we can make some spectacles. I think it's spectacles. Or was it just glasses? Okay, so that's uh, one sec. Let me just check my notes to make sure I've got this, the 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 name of this right. Uh, Sorry for being swipe for a sec. Um, uh, yeah, I think it is spectacles. I thought I've written it down, but I can't seem to have. Spectacles, forestry for Minecraft. We need a bit more morons and a couple of glass panes. There we go, we can do that. So, bronze. And. Oh, I had some glass panes. I'm sure I didn't use them. Let's see if they're in here. No? Okay, let's go and make some glass panes. Bit of a, a pain, but can't be helped. Are we? Let's be glass. Let's be glass. Two, three, four, five, six. Get the juicer out of there. Let's make some glass panes. Like that. So there and there. This is a pair of spectacles, and we wear them. Okay. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Oh dear, oh dear, they can't quite fit with the skin there, look at that. It's like wearing them on the top of my eyes. It's like I've got them stuck on my forehead. <laughs> so, alright. That's, uh, that's more than a little weird, but there you go. Right, with spectacles, I'm going to be able to come along here and have a look and occasionally one of these leaf blocks is going to be discolored it's a bit like using a silkworm so we have a discolored uh, block and that is going to have check make sure they're running all right okay that's running okay uh occasionally those that, those miscolored blocks are going to be um they are going to be a different species of tree, and I should be able to get that down and plant the tree. And away we go. Yeah, sorry about that. It's a uh, no. Well, I, I have a pretty good idea of what's going on. The fact that it's Sunday is probably what's going on. Uh, in all honesty. Okay, so right, we deployed the bees. Cut the bees. We still need to make that apiary to do this quest. And I would very much like to make that apiary, if nothing else, because it opens up the rest of the quest. So let's see if this has worked yet. Alright, so we have one more of those. Still not working. Okay, let's go and get him. Let's go and get him some more seeds, and let's uh, probably need to make some aluminium cans now as well. But we will get it working. Um, at the very least, Mike to make uh, an apiary before we're doing this, and I'm going to want to move on to do something else. Will you go away? Thank you.
Yes, and this is the reason why I pla planted all this corn, uh, wheat, to be honest with you. So we'll pick all this up. What should we throw away? Let's throw away those bones. Oh, please don't apologize about it, bit late. Um, if nothing else, you were there first, my dear. Don't worry about it, okay? Right. Let's get this. Let's get this. Let's get this road on the show, shall we? Just make as many seeds as we can. Okay, that's all those seeds. They start filling that up. There's only one can left. But what I think, I think I'll make some more cans if I can. Uh, <clears throat> if you'll pardon the pun, can. Empty. Oh, come on. Seed oil can, seed oil can, right, seed oil can, okay, so they're made out of those, and those are tin, tin, and tin, or aluminium, aluminium, and aluminium, what have we got the most of? Tin. So that will make us 12 new cans, that's great. Just stick those in there, and let them fill with seed oil. Like that. Uh, it's still saying it's missing resources. Let's just have a quick look at that again. So, impregnated casing. Right, so that will take seed or cans. And that is just a circle of wood. That appeared immediately by itself, so it understood the recipe. So it's, I think as far as it's concerned, it needs to be full of oil before it will do anything, which is a touch annoying. But we'll find out in one more. If you've got homework and you have a whole week ahead... So, have I got anything to do with Thorncraft? No, I haven't yet. I will, I will be doing so, but there's a, there's a few things I want to do first. One of them is to get this pig in apiary sorted out, so we'll let that run. Um, let's go and have a look at our, our, our bees, because I'm proud of our new bees. Still no recolored leaves. I don't know how long it's going to take, but we will find out soon enough. Do you see this bar has gone down? So... Basically, we've got about halfway through this uh, Forest Queen's life. So, um, I think by this time tomorrow, we will be replacing her, but that's not the end of the world. Okay, so, <clears throat> while we're, we're doing this, let's have a look at something called a Bealizer. Okay, so, let's see how we make one of those. There we go, so it's a Bealizer. Okay, we make that in a carpenter again. Uh, but this time we need water. So it's tin, redstone, diamond, redstone, tin, tin, and glass panes, glass panes. We can do that, so we'll have to do that next. A bealizer is an analyzer for bees. It'll allow us to uh, uh, look at stuff and look at the bees and see if we can identify them. Uh, I hope this uses all this because otherwise I'm going to have to make uh, well I'll sort that out later on but the uh, other thing I want to make is an apiarist's chest which is this thing here and that is made with a chest with combs around it which we can't make just yet because we don't have the combs but we'll get round to that and I believe this will work with just honeycomb. Yep, so one thing we can do is take my supply of uh, 
hives because I've got a few of them floating around and we can break them to see if we can get some honeycomb out of them it's not guaranteed but let's see if we can do it oh, if only I can remember where I put them to be honest with you I really need to get this area organized uh, shout out if you see a load of beehives yeah Skyrim's on the poll this week I'm not going to say it's winning, but I'm also not going to say it's losing. Let's take these out here. Give them a good bashing. One, two, three, four, five. And one, two, three, four, five. This is a Meadows Hive, by the way. Okay. Oh, that ran out. Wonderful. But still... We got loads of stuff out of it. <clears throat> mm. Let's go and put this stuff away. And it looks like I'm going to start need fairly soon. We're going to start needing a chest just for bees, which incidentally is where the apiarist chest comes in. But uh, we'll deal with that later. So. Grab some more. Just one left. Excellent. Uh, that chest. No, that chest. Oh. Got loads of princesses out of that lot. I'm really impressed with that. Possibly use a few more drones, but uh, never mind. These things are actually quite easy to make, so that's not really a problem. Uh, so let's put that one away. Okay, and need to make another scoop. Is sticks, which I don't appear to have, like that, and a bit of wool in the middle. So they're really nice and cheap to make those things. <laughs> You're not doing as Simon says. Yes. So Ola Benjamin will uh, curse you in her sleep. Right, I think we've got enough to do that now. And I notice we've got another princess out of that. So we're certainly not going to be short of meadows bees which is great so right apiarist chest need a chest a glass and the honeycomb so let's start making some stuff chest first piece of glass and then honeycomb all around so let's I'll put that down. Let's put that down here. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. And we can then drop some of this stuff off for a sec. Take these and pop them in here. Okay. And it's just a place for Storing our bees. Storing our bees. And we'll pop those in there as well. <clears throat> and what you can do here is you can put your mouse over and get information about them. But of course we don't know anything about them yet because we need the bee analyzer. And we can't do the bee analyzer without this squeezer. So let's hope this makes it work. Okay, that's not working, is it? <laughs> right. Um, okay, for the uh, the sake of brevity, I'm just going to go into creative and load up uh, an apiary.
Now this went disastrously wrong the last time I did it, but uh, apiary. So there we go. That's one apiary. Right. We're just going to cheat. I'm sorry about that. I do apologise about that, but we're going to cheat. I do like my glasses. Aren't they wearing out already? Right, possibly because of all the explosions. Uh, okay, right. Um, so let's do a quest while we've got the apiary. Figure a star. Bees and trees. So, manually detect, there we go, so we can claim the reward. It's going to give us a load of hives. Oh, tropical and marshy, that's types of bees we don't have already. So that is excellent. Right, I'm going to put those in there for now. We will look at those later on. Uh, let's get that heart down there and let's get that reward bag in my inventory. So, let's do the heart. Another life. And a rain muffler. Oh, that's so excellent. Right, okay, so. Right, so let's open up the next one, which is the Beerlizer. So, first thing we need to do is make a centrifuge. Let's give that a try. <laughs> Marshy bees, they come with little wellies. <laughs> centrifuge. Sturdy casing, copper this time instead of bronze, glass top and bottom. I'm starting to see a pattern here. Okay, so that's sturdy casing is bronze all in a row. Let's make that. So we want. Just make a load of this stuff, I suppose. Where's the copper? Ah, uh, we don't have enough to make it. Alright, let's go and have a look at my stuff's tray. Alright, it's so a copper. Okay, we can make eight more like that. Let's do that. So we make so took the broken in a square, stick it in the uh, um, stick it in the chest, uh, stick it in the, the uh, burner, and away we go. So that will make us. The stuff we need. So while we're waiting, let's have a look at this. Right, another can. Can we do it? Probably not. Right, okay. I have no idea why that is not working. I have none whatsoever. I, it's got power. Yep, it's got power. Alright. Uh, Uh, oh, 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 oh. This isn't actually using the wood. This is just laying out a pattern. There you go, guys. That's why it wasn't working. This is just laying out a pattern. It wasn't actually consuming the oak wood. I wasn't placing it down. I was just telling it what to make. So there we go. Job's done. One impregnated casing. I can use that to make another apiary, which I probably will do. So there we go. We now know the reason why. Uh, what state is this in? This is pretty full. So what I'm going to need to do is well, let's finish. Let's finish working with this first. But I'm going to need to make a, a pipette to empty out that. Put that there. That there. Okay, so that gives us that much, and it was like that, like that. Hold on a sec, one step ahead of myself. That sturdy casing is that. Okay, so we stick that in the middle there, and then it was copper down each side. Glass top and bottom. There we go, and that is a centrifuge. So, there we go, we can claim this reward. So, tropical hive or reward bag? Oh, it's going to give us a beerlizer. Excellent, don't even have to make it. Excellent, right. Oh, okay, I do need to make it. <laughs> right, okay. So, that's given us a carpenter and a centrifuge, and 
me now. We need to make a bee elizer, a tree elizer, and a honey drop. Now I won't bother doing that for the quest just yet, but I will put this centrifuge up here. Let's have a look at it. Well, that's not working because it's got nothing in there. Um, I wonder what happens if. Have I got any? Yes, I have. Centrifuge, 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 centrifuge. And a honey drop. And some beeswax. That's what the centrifuge is for. Excellent. Okay, so we'll put that honey drop in there and the beeswax in there. We'll probably use those later on. Uh, oh yeah, that's what I want to make. I want to make a pipette. That's like that. A pipette is light grey wool and two glass panes. Okay, so stick a bit of wool in there. And I left the glass panes over here, didn't I? And if I understand right, I, okay, not a huge amount. Uh, pick up those empty cans and see. If Ah, okay, that'll do. So we can pick that up and put that down. I'm sorry, this is going to be a tad tedious. But I think I've learned a lesson now. Like that. Yeah, um, I think, yeah, sort of bees have a lot to answer for. But, you know, they only ever answer by saying Zzzz, so it's a waste of time even having a conversation with them, to be honest. Right. Uh, there we go. Wow, this is boring. But hopefully I will never have to do something this stupid again. We live and learn. And we're almost there, thank goodness. That's... Okay, so... That's all in there. And if I put those cans in there, they'll actually... There we go, they'll fill up with seed oil. That's excellent. Right, marvellous. Right, okay, so we want to make a bealizer. Bealizer. Okay, so that's tin, 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 rin, tin, tin, redstone, redstone, plain, plain. Okay, we can make that quite easily, as a matter of fact. So let's grab our tin, our glass, and we're just going to need a diamond. And I happen to have seven of them. So there we go. So back into the carpenter. Clear this pattern. Like that. Like that. And tin, wasn't it? One, two, three. One, two, three. Have I got that slightly wrong? I've probably got that slightly wrong, haven't I? Ah, redstone. That's the, uh, that's the last thing. Okay, so let's grab our redstone. And one there, one there. I swear I got that right now. I know it needs water, but tin tin, redstone, diamond, redstone, tin tin, glass, glass. This is more work than it's worth. <laughs> okay, let's see if it just needs some water. Yep, that's what it needs. Uh, does it need some more water? Possibly. 
Let's check that again. Yeah, it needs some more water. Let's go and get it some more water. You know, guy, jolly, golly, guys, this is starting to make some sense. Right. You know, for a given value of sense. Hello, Rory Simmers. There we go, and it's making us a beerizer. 